you know your smartphone is more powerful than most computers in space right now? A few smart folks at NASA realized this as well and thought, hey, why don't we turn a phone into a satellite? And so PhoneSat was born. NASA is taking Google Android phones and turning them into cheap spacecraft. And by cheap, I mean under $10,000 each. The first version of PhoneSat is pretty simple. NASA used off-the-shelf CubeSat hardware, batteries, and a Google Nexus phone to prove the concept works. They've tested them at high altitude and in a vacuum chamber. They know the phone sets will work in space, but they're not sure for how long. Could be weeks, or a few years. NASA is going to send them into orbit to find out. NASA will also share what they learned so that others can build on their work. Their goal is to build a satellite platform powered by Android and help others develop software to operate spacecraft. So instead of writing software to make the camera communicate with the radio, you can focus on doing something cool with the camera. If successful, this could be a breakthrough for spacecraft design for two reasons. One, most electronic equipment is custom made for each spacecraft. This makes each piece of hardware incredibly expensive since the cost from design, testing, and certification are all paid for by one project. The cost for designing, testing, and manufacturing commercial hardware are spread out over hundreds of thousands or millions of units. This makes each piece much cheaper. And number two, creating a satellite operating system based on Android that anyone can modify will open up spacecraft development to the hundreds of thousands of web developers out there. Just imagine, instead of writing a new app, you could program your own satellite using a free operating system. Now it's your turn. Would you want your own personal Android-powered satellite? What would you do with it? I'd love to hear your thoughts in the comments below. And if you want to learn more about DIY rocket science, subscribe to my newsletter at DIYRocketScience.com. Thanks for watching.